Well guys, hello, here we are. A little bit of a, uh, well what do you want to call her, old start video. In front of us here we have ourselves our Craftsman mower. Of course, uh, for those of you that are familiar with this here uh, um, engine, or this here deck, as you can say, um, it's got a fairly, fairly reliable engine on her. Um, it's been through quite a bit before I got her, and well, I certainly haven't uh, babied her either. Of course, this mower here was part of a package deal that I picked up by uh, years ago, and I sold off and stuff, scrapped the other um, three quarters of the package, and then left with this here mower. Of course, I um, had to go seek professional help, and I get it fixed because I just didn't have the time to do it myself, and well, it's been running ever since. Well, of course, uh, come the springtime here, it's time to get her going again for another season. Um, first thing we're going to have to check, of course, is uh, the air filter. Now, of course, um, when this thing was tuned up, it had a new air filter on her, but hey, things change over time. Sometimes it gets dirty, sometimes there's, uh, you know, could be a mouse nest in there, you never know. So let's pop her on open. Now, of course, there is some uh, debris from leaves in there, which is expected. And, of course, the filter itself uh, does look fairly clean. So, after giving it a blowout with uh, compressed air, or very least, banging it on something till the dust comes out. I know my air cleaner cover is broke, and that's probably how some of that debris got in there, but at the same time, um, it works without it, and why bother, right? Uh, someday I'll go on the old uh, internets there and see if I can find myself a cover. I could put a piece of duct tape over it, looks like what the previous uh, owner did. Of course, um, I'm going to check the oil, uh, fill the fuel here, and then, uh, well, let's see if she'll start. Okay guys, so the oil's all checked, all that good stuff, the fuel's been filled, she should be basically ready to go. Now, of course, this here mower is one of those fancy easy start ones that uh, basically you don't have to press the primer bulb. It doesn't even have one, so essentially you just uh, yank on the old recoil and uh, she should fire right up. Honestly guys, that was a one-shot deal. That was not edited or nothing. I basically just pulled the recoil once and well, pretty much what you see is what it is. And as always, thanks for watching Maxwell's World. Comment, subscribe, and enjoy.